Hey YouTubers, I picked up a machete and this is how it came to me from uh, Dave Canterbury's Pathfinder Survivor School. This is where I picked it up from. And this is the sh I want to show it to you. I love the handle of this thing. Absolutely great fitting handle. And uh, as you can see right there, oh, sorry guys. And there's the handle. Great fit. See, I've looked at some other ones and I haven't liked them. But you can see that uh, I'm, I'm under no illusion. These are two, whoops, two parts that are screwed together to create this handle. It's got a great fit, great feel, nice and tough. And I need to try to zoom out on this. Quiet, dear. There it is. Great. Now this is it after the video that you're going to see next. Um, I just went outside and chopped a limb that had fallen off of the ice storms we had gotten here in the snow. I'm even going to post a video of uh, some of the kids playing so you can follow that as an aftermath uh, to my uh, being prepared generator and gas video. Maybe I'll link to that too. But that's it. Great video. <laughs> Great machete. Uh, I'm getting better at this, I hope, guys, but apparently not. Uh, this is it. Great. Now, at the same time, it comes in a sheath. It's not bad. I really like this. It came with this. And it's got some good little tips on there. Some things to make you think, maybe. Try to get a little better. And along with some survival tips. Now the sheath, this is a heart, it's a, a canvas type sheath. It's very rigid, it's certainly safe, but, you know, look, it's going to rattle around in there. And to think that you're going to put this in your belt and walk around with with this one there, I don't want to think that that's really going to be it. I'm trying to pull back here a little bit. You're going to walk around with this on your belt and however else you may be working with it. But it also has two holes here in case somebody wants to make some sort of a back brace, hold it that way. I don't really know. I know one thing though, it definitely calls for a lander here. You really need one. And I've got some uh, good camo 550 cord I'll probably make for that. I also ordered some good twine, hopefully for making some snare traps and stuff. But uh, you know, there's nothing really that secret about this. And his book too, which I'm going to read. I can't give you a uh, a breakdown on this thing yet because I really haven't read it that well, but I certainly have flipped it. <clears throat> if you go to his website and check it out, you'll see that uh, this is the waterproof one. He's got some good basic tips, pictures, you know, walks you through. He's got lots of pictures and how to do stuff. I'll probably be adding it to my. Uh, bug out bag because uh, these are things that I need to learn really I don't know that much about this stuff this is the waterproof one you can dunk this in water and still read it. it's not going to go bad you can check out some of his videos and for that so that's it now check out my little video of me uh, hacking apart a limb I wouldn't say that I was expertly cutting it more like hacking it until it fell apart but, uh, thanks guys
Hey guys, just wanted to do an update to my uh, emergency plane. As you see, there's my garage there. I showed you some propane tanks that I was keeping over in here, which got totally buried by the snow that all came off of this roof. Something that hadn't quite happened before. And uh, this pile here. Now this pile has already been worked away at. It was nearly up to the fence. We got the fence to open up just a little bit. But look at all the snow. We have not encountered anything like that since I bought this house in 2002. There's tons of snow out here. And that is Lady Goober. And uh, there's a kid's picnic table. The top of that table is about 30 inches off the ground. You can see it there. And all the rest of this stuff. My barbecue. And my door. There is just so much snow here. Like I said, we're not really quite used to that. So I guess I'm digging out to do. But uh, if I had to, I could still get to that. Wow. Okay, guys. I just wanted to give you an update.